Hi. Welcome. I know why you're here, and it's not to learn calculus. It's to join me in the simultaneous sip. So if you have your coffee ready, please join me. The question we're working on today is, evaluate the Riemann sum for f of x equals 6x to the fifth. Take sample points to be the midpoints, and a equals 1, b equals 9, and n equals 4. Then express the following integral as a limit of sums. And it's the integral from 1 to 9 of 6x to the fifth dx. All right, so we're going to hop right into this one. Start by drawing a number line. Um, the left endpoint is 1. And the right endpoint is 9. We'll break it up into our four regions. Delta x is equal to 9 minus 1 over the number of regions, which is 2. So we have 3, 5, and 7 as the other endpoints. But we're looking for midpoints to be our sample point. So the first midpoint, x1, is 1 plus 3 over 2, uh, which is 2. The next midpoint is 4. The next midpoint is 6. And the last midpoint is 8. And so that's basically all the information we need. So we could write out our approximation for this definite integral as the function evaluated at each of these midpoints times delta x. which when we plug into a calculator, we get 499,200. Now would be a good time to pause the video and comment below what your favorite part about Riemann sums is. Mine is finding the sample points. And while you're down there, might as well smash the like button and subscribe. Okay, back to the show. Okay, now we could evaluate the integral from one to nine of our function which is equal to, by definition, the limit as n goes to infinity of the sum from i equals 1 to n of our function evaluated at our sample point times delta x. So let's draw out a number line again. One endpoint is 1, the other one is 9, and we'll break it up into n subintervals this time, each of equal width. Delta x equals 9 minus 1 over n, which is just 8 over n. And we need a way to describe each of these endpoints. So the first endpoint is 1 plus 8 over n. The next one is 1 plus 16 over n, and so forth. So let's rewrite that. x1, our first sample point, 1 plus 8 over n. Our second sample point is 1 plus 16 over n. And in general, our ith sample point is 1 plus 8 times i over n. So now what we need to do is evaluate our function at this sample point. And we have 6 times 1 plus 8i over n raised to the fifth. And we're done. Let's, we could put it all together now. So the integral from 1 to 9 of our function is equal to the limit as n goes to infinity. That's important. You got to write that. This sum, also very important, i equals 1 to n. And now our function, 6 times 1 plus 8i over n to the fifth times delta x. And that's it. Well, thanks for stopping by. I'll see you next time. Don't text and drive. Bye-bye. <laughs>